Welcome to another episode of Solitaire Quest. I'm the Blood Knight of the Old Republic of Bloodganistan. Like, share, and subscribe. And today, at this moment, at this time, I'm reviewing some more Studio Ghibli. Yeah. So, yeah. Let's get into it, folks. This is movie is called The Tale of Princess Kaguya, and yeah, apparently it's based on the tale of the bamboo cutter. We got some hand-drawn animation, we got some voiceover from a narrator, guy gets some bamboo, magic bamboo shoot with a tiny child. Ask the girl who she is. The tiny girl is, uh, is useless. He meets up with his wife. The tiny girl turns into a baby. So the woman's breasts fill with milk instantly. The baby is growing rapidly. Hold on a moment. I blow my nose. I hate that. It's like... My damn allergies are triggered. They get fucking triggered by uh, fucking dust and dust mites. And yeah, I took a reacting earlier. Sort of been helping. And yeah. So yeah. It's really nice hand-drawn animation. Some kids find out about about their uh, baby about there being a baby at the house. The kid rapidly learns to walk. Wrote down my notebook. Heartwarming. The child rapidly learns how to talk. And I wrote down my notebook. It's like a children's note. It's like a children's book. Like, brought, come to life, you know? Like, the animation, it's like, damn. And she grows bigger. And near, after nearly getting attacked by a bear or boar. The kid... The kid knows the song in the fall. The woodcutter looks for the girl. There's a gold-filled bamboo shoot filled with gold. The girl's getting older. They steal some fruit. Kids steal some fruit from a farmer's field. The woodcutter gets some more robes. The woodcutter must take the girl to the capital. She's still growing. They get some, uh... Get some, uh... Stuff for some food and mushrooms. The girl is still, uh, growing and they must go to the capital. And, yeah, the kid, she didn't return to the village. With the good, with the gold... The woodcutter has a mansion. Yeah, the the money changed her parents. The girl is excited about the mansion and learns of uh, nobility. God damn my nose! Ah oh, man. I tell ya. <clears throat> so.
so yeah. So yeah. And uh, the girl is still a country has a country mentality. She picks up on the Japanese instrument. <laughs> they have a banquet. The girl is bored. The girl refuses to be taught. The girl is given the name Kaguya after playing the Japanese uh, instrument. They throw a banquet. Kaguya is lonely as everyone parties for three days. She runs away from the party. The animation is crazy good as she uh, walks back to her old home. The town is gone because the mountain is dead. The guy explains the cycles to her. She walks in the snow and wakes up back at the mansion. She embraces the aristocracy. She's super beautiful to everyone with supernatural beauty. Everyone wants Kaguya, and there will be an arranged marriage. The aristocrats want her and say the, sh the, the hot words. She wants uh, the treasures from the aristocrats. Kaguya travels through the city and the countryside. She runs under a tree, meets her old friends who are thieves. The kids get beat up. Three years later, and the garden is growing good, misses her old home. One of the aristocrats gets the gifts. Kaguya uh, asks for the story of the branch. The branch is uh, fake and didn't pay the and they didn't pay the craftsman. Another guy shows up with a gift. She asks him to prove that the robe isn't fire is fireproof. Oh god damn. Damn my allergies. God fucking damn. Ah, uh, my eyes aren't watering, but still. Mm. Mm. And the one guy has to fight a dragon. The one guy has to look for Buddha's bull, but finds a flower. And, and yeah, his wife shows up. The other guy is count. The other guy is dead. Kaguya rips up a garden. The magistrate summons Kaguya to be a wife. He gets turned down and wants to see her. She disappears and reappears. Kaguya gazes at the moon, and there's nothing wrong. And there's uh something wrong or something the moon people are going to take her back and she must return to the moon and she doesn't want to return to the moon so yeah some crazy shit's happening folks she remembers why she went to earth they prepare fortifications there's a moon cities and she broke the rules to go to Earth to feel stuff. <laughs> Kaguya returns to the old house and the townsfolk have returned. Kaguya meets the old, her old friend and reminisces. Kaguya tells him she has been f found. They're both happy and laughing. And they both start to fly like Superman. And I wrote down in my notebook, damn the animation is good, you know. She sees the moon and starts to fall into the water. The guy wakes up to reality. The moon people go to the capital and come for Kaguya, and she puts on a crown to return to the moon. Kaguya wants to remember for a moment. Then she wears the robes, and she loses her memories, and she has to return to the moon. And I realize I have not played any solitaire. God damn. 
So, yeah. I'm sorry, folks. You come here for the quest, and you come here for the solitaire. And I, I did not, I've not given you the solitaire. I'm sorry. It's fine, though. It's all good. It's all good. So, yeah. I like this movie. It's pretty nice. It's nice for a kid's movie. I wasn't expecting her to go back to the moon. I'm not going to lie. And yeah, it was really convenient that a bunch of gold appeared in some bamboo. Which, yeah. Well, it was a bit convenient but to move the, the story along. But other than that, it's a nice Studio Ghibli movie. Animation. It's, it's like a hand-drawn. And yeah. It's really good. So yeah, folks, I like this movie. If you if you if you want it, go uh go watch it. I I bought myself the steel book of this movie, and yeah, it's pretty nice. So yeah, I'm the Blood Knight of the Old Republic of Blood Ganistan. Like, share, and subscribe. Stay frosty. Stay sexy, San Diego. Get your jewels in one where you can. I am a spaceman. Invest in GameStop. Support Gina. And uh, peace out, folks. Peace out. And, yeah. Yeah, folks. Uh, yeah. Just uh, make sure... Make sure you have some adequate defenses against the moon peep ninjas and shit. Or, or like the moon people. So yeah. Peace out.